Sorry, buddy. Ah. Good day. It's a great day. What can I say? Jesus, criminy. Easily thirty. Oh man, it's time to start cooking. Hey gang, it's Yanni Hatcher. You guys are inside the fisherman's belly, and our summer is just starting. And man, oh man, it looks like this is going to be the third summer in a row where we've got unusually warm waters. I've been getting a lot of questions for the past months about yellowtail bellies. So today, I'm going to create a barbecue yellowtail belly dish that will blow your minds and I'm going to show you guys how to make a barbecue dry rub, the real deal homemade dry rub. On top of that, I'm going to show you guys how to make the real deal barbecue sauce. So. We're going to go through a procedure and, and clean the bellies and cut them up into strips, put them on a stick, put dry rub on them, put them on the barbecue over the coals. In the meantime, we're going to be making our own homemade barbecue sauce with molasses and ketchup and a few other things. And we're going to put it all together and be in heaven. Trust me, here we go. Okay, we're going to start off with eight tablespoons of brown sugar. There's three, eight. Three tablespoons of kosher salt. One, two, and three. One teaspoon 
of chili powder, one teaspoon of garlic powder, one teaspoon of ground cumin, and one teaspoon of black pepper. And mix. Now you know the secrets of making a dry rub. All right, gang, now that the dry rub is done, it's time to start working on our barbecue sauce. This is a Kansas City style barbecue sauce. It's made basically with ketchup and molasses, and we're gonna have some diced onions and some garlic, a little bit of Worcestershire, a little bit, it's just watch, just watch. All right, we're gonna start off with two tablespoons of some vegetable oil. There we go. Half a diced onion. A little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, a teaspoon of some garlic, Let's just saute. All right, we're going to start with one cup of ketchup. One cup of molasses. Two tablespoons of this homemade dry rub. Here we go. Half a lemon, half a lemon. A third of a cup of white vinegar. A tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce. Okay, and here's our secret ingredient for this barbecue sauce, and that is orange marmalade. We're gonna use two tablespoons of this orange marmalade in our Kansas City style barbecue sauce. Believe me, people will be scratching their head going, why is this so damn good? Let's clean and cut the yellowtail bellies. Here we go. Here we've got the yellowtail belly. All right. Well, the first thing we're gonna have to do is get rid of the rib bones. Just very carefully put that knife under the bone. See how I've got it there? Rib bone number seven. There we go. All right, so let's inspect to make sure we got all the bones. Looks like we got all the bones. Let's get this lining off without butchering the fish too bad. The membrane's gone. The rib bones are gone. Wow. Let's take the skin off. All right, so we, we cut off all the dark meat on the outside here, on the back side, on the skin side. Wow, look at that. Okay, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna cut this puppy right in half. And we're gonna start cutting up our sticks, our strips. My skewers, they've been sitting in water, getting... Looks just like a lollipop, doesn't it? There's one. Okay, so we ended up with 14 of these puppies from a half a yellowtail belly. And now it's time to add the dry rub. We're gonna lather them up with a, just a little bit of oil so that, so that the dry rub sticks. Put our dry rub that we just made and get them on the grill. We're close, we're getting really close. I'm now getting excited, oh my God. All right, a little bit of oil, some vegetable oil. All right. Remember the dry rub, here we go. going out to the barbecue and here is what we're going out there with I'm gonna call them lollipops I'm gonna call them lollipops all right here we go boys this is not gonna take long remember this homemade barbecue sauce 
As soon as we flip these over, it's time to start lathering them up. Oh my God, here we go. Can you hear the noise? Mm. Oh my God, yellowtail lollipops. I don't know what else to call them. Unbelievable. Homemade dry rub, homemade barbecue sauce, and these yellowtail bellies. Man, run home first. Catch a yellowtail, then run home and make these for your family, your friends, or just for yourself. This is Yanni, this is the Fisherman's Belly. Thanks again, we'll see you soon.